From London, England, the linear, legitimate, universally recognized, undisputed heavyweight champion of the world, Lennox Lewis. The record really could stand up to this fellow. 16 stone he's come in there, Lewis. He's a big lad at 23. And he's a bit of a thudding puncher, but Malcolm's getting back, though. Well, Al Malcolm's been in twice with Gary Mason and... He wanted to prime and dive in, but he, he gave him a bit of a chance, I suppose. But it's it's all one-way traffic, a bit like an avalanche at the moment. And that was a... He's got the beating of him, shown him every punch in the book. pounds a week living money so we've got a good deal there It'll be over the first dozen or so fights we can just get on with his work as a fighter that's a good attack well four rounds is as far as the talking to oh that was a good and he's cut Garrell is cut by the left eye and he's in trouble Another right, and he's... This is of um, Lennox's class anyway, he leans back out of range for a punch without actually moving his feet. Just a nice uh, inbuilt radar, if you like. There's and two good jabs, and he hurts Paulus with a right hand. Paulus down. Big bomb. Paulus all over the place, the guard gone. Yeah, the right's getting through, and he's down, and he won't get up. Jones stopped in the ninth round, and in that fight, Jones, in fact, fractured the jaw, and he's hurt by that punch. Champion, he's fought is Tony Tucker. We beat him in five rounds, but Lewis here starting to unload, and Jones in some trouble here in the opening round, and desperate to cover up a right hand. Pitching moments for the man from Bristol, Tennessee. And Lewis now just needs to pick his punches, look for the... Looking severely discouraged. He got him with a good left of his own there. Lewis mustn't get too careless, but look at him digging in the punches to body and head. And there's another right that really rocked Jones. And this could be a very quick finish indeed. Clubbing rights. Jones desperately trying to cover up. He's pitched for... He doesn't want to take too many of those, though. Oh, and a left hook. Simuela, I think, felt that he had beaten the count. Great. The count. Lewis red, Daskala blue. Right hand, and every signs of surviving it through to the end of the first round. Well, slumped to his knee. Murphy's Second nose giving him a little bit of trouble. Round breathing. Surprised me with his wiry type of strength. He's took a couple of good jolting body shots, and he, he hasn't buckled. Body, and you, you can't help but wonder. He's still got trouble with his breathing. Nose has bled quite freely from the early stages. Yeah, it's always a sign. A bit of a signal that he's ready to call it a day. And I think Ron Hackett. A big boy. Oh, oh beautiful, beautiful. Double left hook to the body to the head. And AC just holding on right now, or covering up rather. Reddick Bowl ranked number 10, Mercer ranked number 12. Oh, you think he just did jab his way in and fire them bombs. Axton there, isn't he, Spider? Yes, he is. Boy, a big left hook, and that that hurt AC, and AC went down, but people want to see the uh, James Quick Tillises, the David Bays of this. Uh, his manager, Mr. Maloney, uh, told me, he, he says that that will happen. Oh, that could be a disqualification. It's like a George Foreman, only that much quicker. He see, really what, damages uh, his opponent absolutely. with that jab. But what, the Scotty, what they want to see Lennox do is fight. It continues to look at a sorrowful state. And a good one. His present moment in time is affecting his vision, but he's taking one out of the shell at him. Good body shots. Round six. Lewis and the end. Off a good can't round. be too far. It's all over. 
the eye pouring blood. Good decision from the referee. And we have a new champion. Can sustain him here. He's taking too much and he's badly hurt. He screwed his face up in pain and I really do think this is going to have to be brought to... He's putting everything into a do or die effort. And it's call off. Может быть, я поторопился с тем, что заканчивает. Вот так. Одним ударом справа Льюис поставил точку в этом бою. I think Lewis will want to establish himself the authority right away, and he's certainly doing that. Now, he didn't do this against Mike Weaver last time up. Oh, those bangs around the ribs. He was beaten in a cruiserweight championship, remember, Glenn McClory, with a body punch, but that bit can slip punches, but he can't this one. He's catching him with every kind of punch. Yeah, he's drawn some blood already from one of those uppercuts. Throwing some artillery at him there, Lewis, isn't he? Uppercuts, overarm punches. A contest on the Tyson Holyfield show on November the 8th. Oh, the ring has his ability, but uh, Lewis has taken the play away and the fight away from him and a long... And he's out! He's out in the act of rising, they call that. He can start well, he can feed. Lennox Lewis comes out, pouring it on. Fight game at this uh, moment in time. There's Lewis measuring with the left and firing. Right hand from Lewis. Lewis moving, maneuvering bigs into the ropes. Six feet five. There's a Lennox Lewis now sticking that jab in there. And that Lewis puts it and counting down. Coming in for the knockout is Lennox Lewis. Biggs fighting for his life to stay on his feet. He's wobbly. He goes down, and that's it. He's walking forward, taking a few. That's a good right hand, though. And that, but Lewis knows now that he can hurt him, and he's got through again. It was lucky for Williams that they following left him. Just missing its start. Oh, what a right uppercut. And another one. And a right. And after two rather sluggish-looking rounds, gets the, the winner of Riddick Bow, Evander Holyfield. And he's just getting cleaned out here. Yeah, he's covering up, the, and um, I think he's ready to go. I think he's ready to go now. Did the referee stop this? No. Um... Lewis. Oh, that's a good overhand right and right. He's down. Here we go. He just leans it down, got the leverage. Own crusher Smith. Oh, and Lewis gets through again. He's got him. He's going to be down again here, Lewis. This is explosive. Like he's looking for Angus to try and explode his bombs, but it's all Lewis, and he's got him again. Oh, look at this, just playing with him, and oh, oh, that's oh a left hand good comes out hurt. of nowhere from Lennox Lewis, and Bruno does not look good at all. And yeah. now it's Lennox Lewis who jumps on Frank Bruno. He's got to put his hands up. Lennox Lewis lining up good right shot. hands, and now the ref comes in. Bruno does not look good at all. Eats a big uppercut from Lewis. Right hand comes in. Bruno is barely standing up. That is his it. What a turnaround for Lennox Lewis. Good right hand. Punches. At the bell. Very good chopping left hook. I, I, uh, there's no doubt about it. Jackson's taking the beat. Some of the punches, particularly some that have come from Lewis, like that uppercut. Oh, would he have the same? There he goes. Удар почти не причинил ему вреда. Вот так хороший был Батлер. Вот так такой просто не сдает. Два джеба и справа пробил. И еще раз. В принципе, ну, по-моему, сейчас качнуло даже без... Так, хороший апперкот. Перед этим... 
Так, ну, ой-ой-ой, два апперкота, три апперкота и вот так. Ну, еще раз, нам со всех сторон показывают этот кошмар. Неожиданно ударил справа и еще раз. Вот так. Справа, слева еще. And for Tua it is increasing frustration as Lewis drills him with the right hand and comes on. Lennox Lewis on his way to victory. He has kept the big Tua bomb away. As for that matter has Lewis. He seems for the moment, George. Ooh, it's an unnatural move for right hand fighter telling him not to counter punch. Well, we feared this might happen when we saw the way that punches 
as he comes forward. And now, Luis, who we're planning to gather to watch this. He's got... There's the most sophisticated big right hand. Climbs in his head. Oh, what a... Oh, there's the uppercut again. him from the upper stratosphere of the heavyweight division. Still a heavyweight champion of the world, Lennox.